Hi Vinas, this is Dr. Srikanth from Team Conquer. Now in this session, I'll be talking about instrument formula. So coming to the instrument formula, hope you remember the instrument formula. Okay, every instrument has a formula which is given by series of numbers. Okay, it can be either three series means which has three numbers or either four series which has four numbers right three numbers or four numbers coming to the the first number okay the first number indicates the width of the blade it indicates the width of the blade or the primary cutting edge what is the primary cutting edge for an instrument this is called as the primary cutting edge or the width of the blade and it is measured in most important area and it is measured in tenth of a millimeter for example if the first number in the instrument formula says it is 9 9 means 1 tenth means 0 0.99 millimeter is the width of the blade so they can give a series of numbers telling that this is an instrument formula and they can ask you what is the width of the blade in the particular instrument then the answer will be one tenth of the first number that is one tenth of the first number in millimeters clear so this is the first number that you have to make a note coming to the number two okay so number two is the number two indicates the primary cutting edge angle number two indicates the primary cutting edge angle in a simple words you can remember that number two is a cutting edge angle so as most of these will be angles it is very difficult for you to retain for longer duration of time so the easy way second will have c in it okay and cutting will have c in it okay the second number for an instrument formula represents cutting edge angle and easy way your second number in most of the situations will be more than 50 degrees okay in it is more than 50 degrees okay there are few cases where this second number is absent such cases are called as three numbers as already discussed instrument formula is either four number or three number in few cases the second number will be missing the second number will be missing what case the second number is absent for the instrument which has an angle of 90 degrees so whenever the angle is apart from the 90 degrees whenever the angle is apart from the 90 degrees then only the second number will be considered instrument which has an angle of 90 degrees will not be considered okay that is about the second number okay you can clearly see the first number represents the width of the blade by one tenth millimeter okay the second number represents the cutting edge angle second you can you can easily remember as c c second the third number represents the blade length the length of the blade and the fourth number represents the blade angle right this is for four formula what is the four formula in four numbers formula the first number represents the width the second number represents the cutting edge angle the third number represents the blade length and the fourth number represents the blade angle there is other type of formula where you have three numbers what is that the first number represents the blade width your second number is absent your third number represents the blade length your fourth number represents the blade angle where here the numbers will be one three four okay so they can ask you for a three digit for a three three digit instrument formula what does the second number represents as second number is absent the third number is going to come into the position of second number so for a three digit the second number will be blade length for a four digit the second number will be cutting edge angle i hope you are very clear right next the number three number three has already discussed it represents the blade length in millimeters it represents the blade length now here you are measuring the blade length previously in the first number you have measured the width of the blade here you are measuring the length of the blade the next comes is the fourth number what is the fourth number fourth number indicates the blade angle okay so this number will be less than 
50 degrees. Second number we have discussed it is more than 50 degrees. Fourth number is less than 50 degrees. Okay. So this is width of the blade. This is the length of the blade. Clear. So they have given this formula. This is the instrument formula. So what we have discussed the first is a four digit. Okay. The first number represents the width of the blade by one tenth means it is 1.5 millimeter is the width of the instrument. The second number is already discussed that is the cutting edge angle which is more than 50 degrees confirmed it is more than 50 degrees right. The third number represents the <laughs> the third number represents the length of the blade it is 8 millimeters. The fourth number represents the blade angle which is less than 50 confirmed it is 12 here so it is less than 50. So regularly the questions that are asked for you is they're going to give simple formula they're going to ask what is the position of second what does third means what does four means or they can ask the dimensions particularly most commonly they ask dimensions of the first number because it is one tenth means 15 has to be divided by 10 so the end is 1.5 what are the units millimeters length of the blade is 8 millimeters width of the blade is 1.5 millimeters for this particular question Okay, and the next grade question is instrument which has four number formula. Okay, your GMT and angle farmers has four number formula. Most of the instruments which has an angle of 90 degrees in the second position. So it is not considered. So such instruments will have one, two, three digit formula. Only three digits will be there. Which number is missing out of one, two, three, four, two is missing okay the second position will be occupied by third number and third position will be occupied by the fourth number for an instrument which is having a three digit formula so yeah i'm done for now signing off dr Srikanth from team mds conquer